Oh my god. I feel like something just scratched my back. Look at all those feathers, bro. <laughs> I just heard somebody say, don't leave. Well, supposedly there was a kid beat to death in here. <laughs> Dead bat, bro. Freaking smiley face. Just came from over there. If there's something. Dude, there's something all around me. I heard something there, there, there. Dude, the footstep just continued, bro. Are you serious? What the? In this community of torture. The whole area has vibes. Buried on this land. Laying back here in the dirt. Yeah, that's definitely his work. Now this guy's here. Yeah, okay, now he's coming this way. I don't think he sees me. You're gonna end up going back to jail. What's up guys, this your boy Jody Dean here, Mr. Hunting the Dead. Welcome back to another video. Guys, today we are hot on the adventure trail using Randonautica, using Scaranoia app, my app. Go download that right now, it's only $9.99. So get you out of your house, out of your mind, and into the world. Finding that scary scary, that sketchy sketchy, just like Mr. HTD and Pinkie Pie. Guys, we're out here, we're looking for that scary. We're hoping to find it. Scary places, scary people, scary things. Just no stalker. I see a few dark clouds out there right now, but uh, we're not gonna let it stop us, guys. It's a little bit early, so hopefully we can get a video in today. That is the goal. So people sent you prayers, and, and, and you said you're feeling better. I am. That's Still awesome. Still, my voice is here and there, but yeah. I'm feeling better. Yeah, you got you some pumpkin coffee? I or, did. All right, awesome. So right now, I am very excited, guys, because we have pre-sold 270 tickets for this year's haunted house Dean's haunted mansion that is amazing we still have like a month until we even open why the hell am I using this seriously I'm just so excited man it looks like this year is gonna be a huge blowout just so you guys know there are going to be some videos towards the end of October showing you Dean's haunted mansion some of the crowds and things like that because I want you guys who can't make it to get a little slice of that pie Sketchy, sketchy stuff in sketchy places. You don't remember who suggested it, dude? I think it was Diane, but I'm not sure. Whoever suggested sketchy stuff in sketchy places, I'm seeing something right there on the way to it. It's just a big old queen king size mattress laying behind this place. Of course, it said thrift store on the back of that place, but they don't look like they're in business. Uh, big shouts out. I, I believe it's Diane. You know what? Shouts out to Diane whether or not I got it right or not. She's been a great supporter. And big shouts out to all you guys suggesting these awesome intentions. Looks like an abandoned building right here. But the pinpoint looks like it's over cheer. Sketchy stuff and sketchy places. Well, there's a huge ass light just laying down right here. Huh. You think a storm knocked that down or you think... They intentionally bulldozed it. Or somebody hit it with their car. Some. Um. Just lock it, just in case. I ain't going too far, but just in case. You got the gun in the backpack too, in case you need it. Sketchy stuff in sketchy places. Well, I wouldn't say that a light is sketchy. However, it just laying down like this is a little unusual. First one of the day here, though. You gotta examine. Damn. That electric running through the ground right there. Somebody should probably come and unhook that. Or this place could get haunted real quick. I usually like to at least scour a little bit, 500, 500 feet within the pinpoint. Okay, that building is closed. Let's see if there's anything else. glasses back on real quick look at the top of this thing whoa 
Holy hell, there's a big old nest in that bitch. Old phone thing. Is it still attached? Must be. Be cool if this thing was open. I went into an abandoned uh, grocery store one time a few years back, and the paranormal activity was just insane. And I think the reason it was is because kids had been in there um, drawing all this satanic stuff and all these witchcraft symbols. Not that the two were related at all they can be black magic but it wasn't like dark magic witch stuff but it was conjuring stuff so i think that somebody had summoned something really bad there all right so i don't know um that's a little sketchy but it's not quite you know sketchy enough. it's not sketchy and exactly alicia it's not sketchy know. enough maybe we're sketchy we are we're sitting here in the middle of a parking lot <laughs> Maybe that's it. Filming what? Oh, Maybe that? there's something sketchy inside of it. I don't know. Let's go see if it smells like dead bodies real quick. Let me pull up. I can't really see. I'm trying to pull up, Shawty. I'm trying to pull up. All right. Now we're being sketchy. We are. Eh. I think it's just, I think it's just the I hall. I think it's chilling. I don't smell dead bodies, so. <laughs> All right. Why don't you get us a, a, a location for the next one? Uh, we're going to use Sketchpocalypse. We used that in one of our recent videos. Somebody loved it. They said, please use that again. That was really cool. So we're going to do Sketchpocalypse. All right, guys. So we're about to arrive at the next location in a minute here. Oh, wait. Actually, we're going to turn right where these people are, it looks like. Intention Sketchpocalypse. And I actually was designing some merch that says Scotch, uh, Sketchpocalypse on oh, Scotchpocalypse. Uh, Sketchpocalypse on it htd for life it looks really cool uh we're going to be dropping that probably about the time of this video so definitely click on our teespring store below um check our hunting the dead store on teespring we're going to have a tank for girls and a shirt for guys and oh i see a fence i see garbage and... and i see somebody sitting there in a truck you see that shit look at this Okay, it, it's got the elements of a sketch apocalypse. Let's see. Can we go through here or no? I don't know. It's sketch. Okay, where's the pinpoint? Right there. Okay. I was Shit. turning around. This sounds bad. This don't feel good. Like, I feel like I'm running over stuff that could probably mess up my shit. I like... You pointed about right here. Um... Well, there used to be something here at some point. Looks like a whole bunch of mess. Okay, yeah, I'm not I'm not going to go any further. I don't want to run over no nails. However, I don't know about a sketch apocalypse, but definitely something used to be here and this looks like a bunch of the There was a chicken bone. Rub, was it? Yeah. Little rubble and some trouble. What the fuck was that? Oh no, I thought I seen like a camouflage dildo or some shit. <laughs> Judy? Well, why would saying. somebody use a camouflage one? Maybe they don't want to see a bitch coming. <laughs> I'm just saying though. Oh, what's that? What, what, what? Uh, 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 what is it? Oh, it's a banana peel. Oh, that's super sketchy. A banana peel. I did the banana peel. I did the banana peel. Yeah, hey, that truck's leaving. Oh, what were you doing, sketchy truck guy? All right, we're pulling out of here, guys. Stay right here. Yeah, let me stay back from Mr. I don't know what he was doing, just chilling right here. Maybe that was his banana. Yeah. He was getting some sloppy. I turn left? Yeah. Well, we got a lot of traffic coming, guys. Uh, the intention we're using now is traumatizing fears. 
Um, doesn't look like it's too much further away. We're gonna be heading that way. Okay. Whoa. I feel like we're getting cornered. There's a red truck. There's actually a red truck. If you look in your rear view mirror, there's a red truck behind us back there. Which says the same thing there. on that red truck. Okay, maybe it's some kind of construction company or something. But. Traumatizing fears. Once again, uh, suggested to us by Olive. Thank you so much, Olive. Olive oil. All right, we're gonna get it any day now, guys. I promise it's gonna happen. I'm traumatized right now by this traffic. But I do not fear it. Hope we find something cool with this one. It's a great intention. I love intentions like this. You put two words together and they have a word baby. A baby of words. Wait, it's right here. What do you mean it's right here? What do you mean? The bridge? It says creek. Okay. Okay. Turn here. Turn here. You think I can turn here? Well, no, this is dead end. Turn here. What, and I can walk to it from right here? I don't know. Yeah, that's just dead um, end, bro. Uh, it, it's under there, though. Oh, wait, maybe I can get back here. Hold on. I want to do it. So does it look like it's on the bridge, under the bridge, by the bridge? I see water. And I see... Oh, there's a lot of holes uh, over here. Do not take your truck through this. I'm going to see if I can. There's a little road to it, but it looks a little... Oh yeah, there's a big hole right there. I probably could ride over. You know what, fuck it, I'll just walk to it. All right, traumatizing fears, another bridge. What if it's a haunted bridge? That could be pretty crazy. Oh, and you see those stairs over there? Yo, this might be super sketch. Hey, lock it up just in case, okay? Traumatizing fears. When you guys are using Randonautica or my app, always make sure that you look along the way, guys. Sometimes you can find your intention on the way there. I've always preached that because it's so important. Uh, people will hit me up and they'll say, hey, you know, I'm using the app. I, I, I find some stuff. I don't find a lot, though. And I ask them what their methods are. When they tell me, I'm like, dude, there's a lot of holes in what you're doing. It's You really got to be observant. We might want to check over there too. I got sketchy vibes coming from over there more than over here. Those stairs right there though, this is like in the middle of nowhere. It's quite unusual. I asked somebody the other day, I said, when you, you know, when you use these apps, how long do you spend at a pinpoint? And they told me about two or three minutes. Sometimes it takes 10 to 20 minutes, guys, and I personally don't like to give up until I find something, but... Oh, there's some writing. Hold on. Gotta make sure I don't step on a snake out here either. A lot of these snakes blend right into this little mess. Alright, it looks like it's just some basic kid stuff messing around. But those stairs, I don't know, there's a vibe about those. Let's see what's over here. Little swamp creek. Oh shit! What the hell is that? Dude, is that blood? Dude, that looks like a bag with blood in it, bro. Wait, is it blood or is it tomato sauce? Ooh, I don't freaking know. That's sketchy. Keep on hearing something back that way. Hopefully she'll stay on guard and honk if she hears anything, sees anything. Is it say up there? Kinds of shit over here. Ah. 
G13, Laura, bitch, no fakes. Man, they got deep with this one, huh? Yee yee. <laughs> yee yee. Why you all in my grill? All right, all right, Jody. Work your way down. Work your way down to Chinatown. This bridge looks like it's on its last leg, man. Looks like Barnacle Billy up under here. Look at this shit. Good lordy. Good lordy, shorty. You must be going off that water bottle. <gasps> Holy yuck a moly, bro. There's a freaking doll hanging there. Wait, what the fuck's wrong with their eyes? It says boob, smiley face, doll, hanging, broken glass. Dude, somebody might have been out here conjuring, bro. Whoa, what the hell? Look at this. What the fuck is this? Is this like a trap or some shit? They said to themselves, I know Mr. HTD's gonna come here. Let's rig up a doll. I don't know if I should touch it. See, sometimes I wish I had a direct line to you guys. Like, I could just go live right now and be like, should I touch this or not? Oh my God. Look at all this graffiti. I don't know. I got to think about this for a second. Let's hang out for a second and see if Mr. Stalker shows up. If he doesn't show up, then maybe I'll touch it. Looks like it's got a booby trap going on or some shit. All right, it reeks over here, bro. Reeks over here. Why does it reek over here? When I say it reeks, I, I don't mean... It smells like a field of marijuana. It smells like a rotting corpse. What is that? It's a backpack. Could be an item of a missing person. Man, I bet you there's a bunch of sketchy shit over here, bro. Something broke up all apart over there. We'll, we'll check that out one second. I'm just keeping my eyes open right now for this guy. You never know when he's going to pop up out of nowhere. The dude's like a whack-a-mole. I just don't got one of them things to pound his head in. Yeah, I do. I got one of these. Oh, there's like a fucking trail through this little bitch. Oh, there's a tent back there, too. Somebody's camping, bro. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. It's fine. We don't want to mess with them if they're camping. Oh, okay. That looks like that's just pieces of plastic or something. Yep. All right, so it's just some shredded plastic. I'm sure whoever's camping back there is most likely homeless and this is their home base. Oh no, I kind of want to touch this doll, but I, I, I do and I don't. Creepy eyes, bro. The hell is that? Oh man, that thing's still holding on to the doll. Look at that shit, bro. You imagine somebody driving by seeing this, they'll be like, he's carrying a freaking creepy hanging doll 
Hopefully they don't think it's a real, real be. What the fuck was that? Okay, I just heard something behind me. Yo, there's like a garbage bag over there. I'm gonna show this to Alicia and see what she wants to do. Hello? I'm gonna see if she wants to do a spirit box or she wants me to leave it here. Of course, she always tells me to leave it here and I always end up taking it. It's like I like to ask what she thinks, but I don't like to listen to the <laughs> great advice. Well, it doesn't reek over here like it did over there. It might reek like a dead corpse over there in those woods because somebody's over there probably wrapping the shit up. Or just shitting everywhere. Whew. Sketchy place, bro. Sketchy, sketchy place. Oh, thing got wrapped around my ankle. I thought a snake done grabbed me. Oh, there's a little pathway through here too. All right, this is outside of. Let's hear something again. This is outside of 500 feet, guys. Now I'm just exploring at this point. Oh my God. Yo, 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 yo. Just lost my footing. Lots of footprints in here. Somebody's where lots of people come here. Maybe they come here to fish, I don't know, but it's spooky. Spooky ooky. It's spooky ooky. Smells like somebody took a dookie. And Jody's about to pukey. Man, there's all kinds of shit going on around here, bro. This is like a all kinds of pathways and hidden looking shit. Ooh, what kind of lizard is that? It's like a skink or something. Better work my way back to the, the truck. I've been had a bad feeling, but it's starting to get worse. I think this doll hanging there could be traumatizing fears for a lot of people. Maybe not I, but some people are scared of dolls. Some people are, are scared of, of spirits and spirits love to attach themselves to these things. I don't, I do understand why, because they're so human-like, but at the same time, it's like, if you could attach yourself to anything, what would you guys attach yourself to? I want to know. Leave that in the comments below. Look what I found! What? She's honking the horn. I don't know if that's good or bad. Or She's just saying, hey, I, I see it. Whatever I heard behind me back there, though, Sounded creepy. Almost sounded like 
something yelled out to me. And when I say something, I mean something, not someone. It didn't sound human-like. When you hear spirit voices so much, you start to know there's something up. You start to know when something's up. Look at this shit. You, you found another place to, to go? This was hanging underneath the bridge and it almost looked like it was like a booby trap or Why something. Why would you take that if it was hanging? I knew you were going to say some look, shit like that. Look. Okay. okay. I'm trying to look. Okay. 400. Two minutes away? Look, Jothan City Schools, right? Yeah. But I don't know if you all can see this. It's literally right here and we're right here. But I don't know how we're going to get to it because... You Where is that? Right over there? Right here. Okay, here, let, let's get this in the vehicle real quick. Let's turn the car around and... I want to do a quick spirit, what do you think? I was going to ask, do you want to do yeah, a spirit box? Yeah, All right. All right, guys, we're going to do a quick spirit box session here with this doll. She's got some super creepy eyes. Um, can you tell me how this doll got under the bridge, how you got under the bridge if you're attached to this doll? <laughs> Had help? Didn't it sound like that? Didn't it sound like it had help? Please. Yeah. It's hard to hear with the truck. Is there something attached to this doll? No. What? Death? <laughs> and I'm holding it. <laughs> you bitch. Is Did it, it say you bitch? bitch? What? Why am I holding this? Is there something bad attached to this doll? Whoa, yo. What's in the locket? Did you look like in the locket? Cross. No, there's a locket on it? Oh my Yo, god, what? Jody. Uh-uh. Does it open? It says something. What is this tied around its freaking neck? <gasps> There's a pit. No, no. Oh my Are you serious? Oh Are you god. serious? Hold it oh up. Hold god. it up. Hold it up. I don't even want to touch this thing Hold now. Up. Hold up. Can you see that? Oh. <gasps> Yo, is that a picture what? of the doll? Yes. What the f Bruh. That is next level creepy. I've never seen that before. Dude, her eyes look so real. Like you. Who did this doll belong to? There's a name in Matt. it. Matt. It said Matt. Is this baby? <laughs> baby Margarita. Baby Margarita? Huh. She don't look like a margarita. Baby Dude, Margarita. I got the chills right now. Her hair looks different in this picture, too. Who is Baby Margarita? <laughs> you say Alicia? And look, M. And it's got an M on it. The chain right there. Did somebody die at this bridge that's so attached much. to this doll? There's like prickers all over it. Doll? I say doll. Can you say your name? Is it Jody? Jody. I would have left this thing. I would have You want to leave it. it? I mean, we I can leave it. it. I just. At least let's put it in the trunk. You want to let's do that? Yeah. All right. You said you got us an, a, another yeah, location. Okay. So. And it's well, just like, what'd you say? Like 100, 400 feet? 400, like it said. Like walking distance. Well, 350 now. Okay. So look. Whoa, that's really like it close. It says to go out on this road, but then Dude, come back on this road. Dude, pumpkin way. And pumpkin. Like, and I had pumpkin today. And... That looks, that looks yo, like, that a looks like a cemetery. That's what I'm saying. An old one. 
Okay. But it's all woods. I didn't wait, see you didn't anything. change the intention, so it's still traumatizing fears? Yes. And I'm that like, could be it. Dude, we found a doll, and you're telling me that? there's a cemetery next to here? That's what... I, but look, it's in the middle of the woods. How do you All right, get to let's, it? All right, let's... Here, let's just go to it real quick. All right, For I'm not even going to stop filming. Um, Just... Here. Here. I just got hit the face. Put her in the floorboard real quick. What? Yeah. You're going to keep her in the car? <laughs> well, let's see. Man... I'm gonna send this to Tiffany for Christmas. It, it looks, uh, Omar Stephanie. Yes. <laughs> it looks like it's behind us on the map. You know, I'm gonna back up because I don't know what's in this grass over here. I don't know what's in this place here. Okay. Okay, it looks like it's that way. So it's right here. How can we get to it? Hold on, let me see. Yeah, you can see it. Dude, you can see it through there. Look, there it is. There's a freaking cemetery on the hill. How do we get to it? Bro, are you serious? All right, so. Let me see if there's another way to get to it real quick. And then I'll I'll, I'll, I'll tap back into this. Hold on, guys. I'll, I'll be back in a second. Maybe I can get to it this way. Yeah, it looks like a circle. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, I'm just blown away. Traumatizing fears was a good one. I'm so glad this was suggested to us. And Olive's a G too. She's literally the only person I've ever known with the name Olive. Turn here. Oh, Turn here. Oh, okay, okay, there's not really any kind of turn. I just go. Oh shit. We gonna die making this video. Just do it. I'm watching the road. On, on the a thing. dirt oh. road. Don't know where to go. Coming off these pills. They put me in my zone. This is so dangerous. What are we doing? <laughs> this could collapse. I don't know. But hey, McDonald's has any size, any flavor, one I don't price. Care about that. Look. Hey, why don't you take this one? You need to get out and, and get some cardio in. I got my cardio. Oh. My Yo, gosh. creepy cemetery, bruh. Creepy, creepy. Holy mac and cheese balls. Yeah, you take this one. Here you go. Okay. Here you go, honey. You can have that. There you go. Hey, that. You're looking for traumatizing fears. Of course. Everything's traumatizing in this world. Okay, let's take a look in here. Wow. I want to come and put flowers on every single one of these. Let me pull this up on the map a little bit more so I can see. I'm watching the map as I go, guys. So right here is the point. I mean, this whole cemetery, I mean, people die and it can be traumatizing what happened to them. So I, that could be it. I am gonna explore this just a little bit to see. Yeah. I'm not going to show no names out the respect. Look at that beautiful Um, look at that beautiful cross. Yeah, I definitely want to go to like the Dollar Tree and get some artificial flowers and come out here and just put it on everybody's grave to let them know, like, somebody's thinking of them. At least. Wow. I, I just think it's like, people that are buried here, maybe that's the point. 
because there's nothing laying around. That's it. Look at that old, old one there. Jody just recently found a couple headstones on the back of his property in Georgia. And I've contacted a university to see if they will come out to do the ground pit training radar, which we can see if how many bodies are actually a thing. What? Tiny? Timmy? That's odd. So odd. I don't see anything. I mean, it's everybody laid to rest. It's traumatizing. Let's walk back. Look at that beautiful truck. He's worked so hard to make his dreams come true. And look right there. Could be another Dean's Haunted Mansion billboard. Huh? What you find? Traumatizing. What's traumatizing about it, Alicia? People laying on the ground. That's traumatizing. They could have had a traumatizing death. I ain't buying they it. Did you find I was it? saying. What? That could be your billboard. It could be. But another I mean, one. People are going to see it standing over here by the cemetery. I said I want to come back with some artificial flowers. I already got dead people at Dean's Haunted Mansion. I know. I was talking about that. Too. Okay. Good. All right. So yeah, that was it. Just the bodies laying. Man, get in the damn car. You get in the damn car. Guys, we're about to be pulling up near the next pinpoint. Maybe, possibly. Wait. This looks so friggin' familiar, dude. I have no oh idea God. why, but again, why is it taking us by bridges, though? Don't That's move. what got. What's wrong? What do you see? Bunch of shit. Okay. What do you mean? Like shit, shit? Like poop or, or like just garbage? Garbage. And... Okay. All right. I'm not worried about garbage. I'm worried. I know, but I don't want to. Where do I know this from? Oh, you see that sign over there? When... Somebody wrote on that sign. Mickey. Yeah, it says Mickey something. Else. Um, how far is the pinpoint? Five hundred. Five hundred feet that way. I wonder if that path. You know what? I've been here before. Dude, this makes so much sense. That's what's Mickey something. Too. Okay, uh, it, it was spiritual anomaly, right? Yeah. I I believe there's a haunted spot my friend what? Deeker brought me to in these woods a long time You're ago. You're not going by yourself. Ah. <sighs> Look, there's a helicopter. I don't even remember if it's sketchy, those... how sketchy it is. There's a trail I know it's right sketchy. Here. I don't know how sketchy. Behind me, there's a trail. I think this is the way he took me, and you're saying the pinpoint's this way. It might only be accessible this way. I'll, I'll look, all right? Oh God, hey, listen like, to me. I'm bringing my phone. No, I'm not. You have the gun. You have the gun. Somebody's going to live. It's going to be you. Lock it. Hey, just if, if anybody pulls up, like anybody at all. Wow, this is sketchy, Alicia. Good Lord. If anybody at all pulls up, just honk the horn so I know. Whether you're in trouble or not, just honk the horn so I know somebody else is coming. All right. Wiping off my glasses, guys. It's get foggy as soon as you step out that truck. Hey, we might actually find some paranormal activity if this is the place I believe it is I'm pretty sure this is the place my friend brought me to a long time ago I love winter I love winter too I'm sick of this summer shit I think it is damn I got a bad memory or else it's just been that long but I bet you we find a spiritual anomaly over here or some paranormal activity of some sort Yo. This looks different though. Maybe I am at the wrong place. That I'm thinking of. No, no, I see it through there. Yo, you guys, this place is so crazy. So crazy. And look, there's a pathway through the whoa, spider web. There's a pathway through here too. This looks wild, wild. 
and it makes sense why it, it, it's so haunted we did we caught some really crazy evps over here it makes sense though because you got the running water and then you got this foundation here where i guarantee you bodies have been stashed out here i guarantee you people have died out here there's been conjuring out here no telling what kind of shit bro That's slippery if I remember correctly. The Jays are definitely gonna get fucked up there. And I don't I don't care. I'll fuck them up for you guys. I'll fuck them up for you. I just don't know if I can get up in it with these Jays. Jody don't ever have a problem getting up in it, but this thing is it, it, whew, woo, spider web in the mouth, bruh. Kind of, uh, fuck. Oh fuck. Oh shit, dude. I think I might have broke my arm. Fuck. Okay, I didn't break my arm, but it definitely fucking hurts. Oh, fuck. I just slipped and busted my ass. I'm talking about being slick as shit, bro. Ah. Oh, my camera. Fuck. My wrist. Oh, my God. Ow. My fucking back, bro. I already got a bad back. Son of a bitch. All right, my back's hurting, bro. That did not help the situation. That did not help the situation. Oh, fuck. I don't think I'm going to be able to continue, guys. It gets worse right there, and I just hurt my shit bad. Oh, oh I hurt my arm. My back, my butt. Fuck. Ow. And that's the part where I had trouble last time. Not right here, right there. Fuck, I really like hate to throw in the towel on this. God, I don't like letting my fam down. Please don't fall again, Jody. Please don't fall again. Fuck. I wish I knew what you guys want me to do, man. That's where I fell. I'm so I'm so stupid right now. Dude, if I fall again like that, I could really fuck my shit up. I don't know guys oh my god oh my god okay 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 yeah it's too slick i can't do it I, I apologize i'm so sorry i can't do it <sighs> fuck now i'm in pain setting out on a film trip great <sighs> spider web all up in my shit hello has a dead end bro I am hurting right now I don't know if you guys felt the full effect of me falling hey fuck I don't want to see what's under there I wonder if I can go around the other side Dude, even my wrist is fucking hurting. Just unexpected, man. Like, when you can prepare for a fall or have an idea you're going to fall. See, I thought I was going to fall on the other side, not right there. That shit hurt. Could have been a lot worse, though. Hey! I fell! Yeah, I hurt myself pretty bad, actually. It was un unanticipated. Hold on. Oh, this looks rough too. Shit. Wow. Yeah. 
yeah maybe another day sorry guys i feel like i let you down this time we were almost there uh i wasn't even on the part where i i, I thought i was gonna have trouble when me and d came here i remembered i had trouble getting up that other side but uh here wipe me off if you can oh my god you're wet yeah oh. dude it fucked up my my shoulder my arm my wrist and and my lower right back you're bleeding no -uh. yeah you are am i it was happened so quick, dude. I didn't anticipate anything like that happening. Not that you could, but. Oh, your freaking. Am I good? Slippery. Your pants are really bad. Okay, guys. So Alicia and I were just watching the footage of me falling on this camera that I'm filming with right now, and right as I'm falling or about to fall, you hear this creepy, growly voice say it something. Like it, said, get him. it did. It, it sounded like it said get him or hit him or something like something, that. Something, and then you fell. Bro, what if something pushed me to the ground like that? I wouldn't go back there without, like, at least next time if you go back, take Deke with you because he knows those grounds, like, really good. Right. And you'll have somebody having your back because I can't go out there because if we both get hurt, then we're fucked. I, I, I know. Well, and, and and here's the thing. Okay, it really was, it was slick. It was, uh, my feet just lost it. There was no, nothing they could do. However, it felt like I hit the ground with more force than I should have and my shoulder hurting. You're really red on one side of your back and on the other you're red but not as like, I don't know how to explain it. I wish I could show him but it's kind of like- Well, my elbow area. hit the ground, my shoulder didn't and but my shoulder is hurting so it makes me wonder if something did contribute to like pushing uh, me down. It's a black hawk and um- Oh, what a helicopter. Yeah. Dude, that was just, that was crazy. I, I can't believe I'm bleeding on my side. back. I think you need to go get checked out. My back is, is hurting pretty bad. Yeah, I see it. It's coming in over here. All right, guys, we're heading to the next location. Deadly disturbances is the intention. Um, I'm in a lot of pain right now. <laughs> that little slip and fall there in the woods uh, was a lot harder than it probably looked on camera and it jarred my back pretty good. So now I've got quite a bit of pain running up uh, from the lower back, up my up my spine. Looks like we gotta head in that direction over there. Uh, Alicia's probably gonna have to take the next one or next few. And the next We'll video. see here, we're, get, we're getting close. I don't know if we're gonna get to pull out here anytime this soon. Crazy traffic. Put my hat on, I'm starting to feel naked. What's going on with this, man? Turn right. Deadly disturbances. Oh, no way. Pinpoint is right here. Yeah, I know. I'm okay. Yeah, uh, I don't know. How uh, whoa, there's another pathway. Um, and another bridge. There's a road right here. Hey, that's a deadly disturbance. It looks like it's going to collapse any moment. Fall. But wait, that's a railroad track bridge, right? Yeah. I would okay. not be on <laughs> Yeah, I wouldn't either. I'm not gonna let you get out here and explore this one. This is um really bad. Here, let me let me Good let me turn there. around and well, why don't we get up another pinpoint real quick? Let's get no, something that you can no, access. Are you gonna get out and take this one? Cause I, camping I really here. can't. Well, dude, be careful. I mean, if you can go in, go in. If not, then don't worry about it. I know. All right, guys. I mean, it doesn't look safe to go in, but I'm gonna do my best. All that glass. Wow. There's scissors just laying there. That is not safe at all. Hello? There's a Bible right there. Hello? Anybody chilling in here? 
is a hat. Maybe this place used to be like an old store, um, consignment shop, antique store, because there's like antique furniture right there. I think someone's watching. Wow. Look at the beautiful butterfly. It's hard to get that close to butterflies sometimes. Hello? Usually nobody's camping back here and comes out on me. You know, I'll pepper spray somebody, but... In front of a car, automatic transmission. There's a life jacket, gas can. Look at there. A freaking gas can. And obviously this thing has been burnt to a crisp. Wonder if somebody did this on purpose. That gas can don't look like it's been beat up. Hey guys, I can't go back there. There's too much glass. Can you see anything? Tools. Electric. I mean, this had to be an old. Furniture store, or consignment shop, whatever you want to call it. Part of a watch band hats. A lot of plates. Hmm. Well, that's so sad. Everything was like totally went to waste. Shed. Guys, I feel like somebody is watching me from a distance. There is an abandoned car in the woods right there. I wish he had zoom on this camera, but the GoPros, they don't have zoom. You know what? Something is calling me back in here. Like, hey, pay attention to me. Like right here. I thought I heard the door creak. Maybe. Guys, I hear somebody talking. And I know I said hello. Shit, I don't really don't want to go back there. See, now I'm hearing stuff. That's a truck. But I heard a door and I think that was it. What is up with this butterfly? It's like following me everywhere. Guys, no. Maybe there's somebody on the other side of this. I'm hearing somebody. Shit, I did not want to go through this. Guys, I'm only on 10% too. Hello? <gasps> Did something happen to you here? I heard something in here. All right, let me get back to the car. It's about to die. Now it's on 8%. Ooh, that butterfly. It loves me. Let's see if I can go around here before it does die. Oh my god, this is awesome. Maybe. Just maybe. What? 
Wait. I was on the other side of that wall and that's when I heard somebody. And there's nobody here, clearly. What the fuck? I don't know what I hear about. Yeah, there's nobody out here. There's some dirty mattresses. Yeah, that is so crazy. I know what I heard. And it was coming from that room right there. And Jody would have seen somebody pop out. Let me ask him. Hey, you didn't see nobody, did you? No, why? I heard somebody talking in there, but I didn't know that was open. You get me? So. What, this side? Yeah, you didn't see nobody come out. Mm -mm. No, I didn't see anybody at all, period. Yeah, that place Other than was you walking around. set on fire. Yeah, yeah, it doesn't look like it was. Uh... And there's a gas can in there, and the gas can's like perfectly fine. What? Yeah. That's unusual, huh? Yeah. A perfectly fine gas can in a place that's clearly just mm -hmm. blown all to hell. Did you hear any, like, mm -hmm. thing? Yeah? Voices? Yep. Noises? I, I heard the door. Really? There's... So do you think that place is haunted, or? Oh, yeah. There's something in there, and it's like, it's not evil or whatever, but I could feel, like, the energy of something, but it wasn't, like, a mean. I wonder if somebody died in that fire. I should look this place up and see what happened. I'm sure the news article, right? For sure, yeah. Hey guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. I'm sorry I didn't get to access that one place. I really feel bad about that. At the same time, man, I really feel bad now. I'm Like, I'm in pain. Guys, please smash that thumbs up. Please leave comments below. Share this on your social media. We post every other day, live chat, live premiere. We got a live stream happening next after this video, so make sure you catch that one. Big shouts out to Alicia for checking this out for me. Thank you guys for all your support. All the mods all the patrons all the members out there until next time we love you all sweet nightmares on a dirt road don't know where to go coming off these pills they put me in my zone i seen a lot of shit i took a lot of hits i seen a lot of shit they still talking shit on a dirt road don't know where to go coming off these pills they put me in my zone I seen a lot of shit, I took a lot of hits, I seen a lot of shit, they still talking shit. Something has got to give, I think I've lost my way, Cody burned that bridge, in my mind where I used to stay, they say I'm living dangerous out here, when they say I need to face my fear. Told me this would be my year But now I see it all so clear On a dirt road Don't know where to go Coming off these pills They put me in my zone I seen a lot of shit I took a lot of hits I seen a lot of shit They still talking shit Pay so deep and bad These drugs really make Thoughts about my dad And the life I wish I had I don't know I don't know I don't know I don't know No, 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 no I don't know I don't know I don't know No, 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 no On a dirt road Don't know where to go Coming off these pills They put me in my zone I seen a lot of shit I took a lot of hits I seen a lot of shit They still talking shit On a dirt road Don't know where to go Coming off these pills They put me in my zone I seen a lot of shit I took a lot of hits I seen a lot of shit They still talking shit